right everybody here we go we are back yes i have been reading the comments now i don't really do the intros that much anymore because hey most of the people skip them junks but i appreciate the love and the support that y'all give my mom i know y'all like really love when i do reactions with my mother for some reason i don't know what it is i guess it's because i'm not what screaming a lot or cussing a lot or something i don't i don't know but um I, we talked about trying to do like something where she will come on regularly, where we'll do like a classic movie or something like that. But when it comes to me doing these videos, it takes a lot of time y'all. So that's why I haven't been able to really get her on that much. We hope y'all doing all right. We hope that y'all enjoy this video. You know, please support my mother. She also has uh, social medias as well when it comes to like Instagram and then her YouTube channel. Like what is your YouTube channel again? It's Miss Zoe Comedian. Miss Zoe Comedian. <laughs> this is one of the movies that a lot of y'all wanted us to watch. I think, uh, what movie was that with Richard Pryor and Gene Wilder? Oh, uh, uh, Stir Crazy. Like I said, we just hope y'all enjoy the video, but let's go ahead and get into trading place there, everybody. Let's get it. <laughs> that looked like the same street that Rocky was running up. Mm, how to do, though? Was it? I'm thinking, when was the year this was out? I can't remember because I'm looking at all the clothes and everything. Yeah, everything. I was going to uh, mention that too. It's real nice seeing these 80s movies and just seeing how people was dressing back then. Yeah. A lot of people was dressing like serial killers. Dahmer. That's what <laughs> Get them Dahmer glasses and stuff on. Oh, these dudes are bummy. How y'all miss that? Office Man, of Employment Security. <laughs> nah, somebody's probably mad and they came back and wanted to shoot the place up. Put the money in the bag! Put it in! Talking about burnt? Yeah, I know, right? That's what I'm looking at. What type of butler is that? He lost his job right in there. Pork bellies. They used to always talk about pork bellies back in the day. I always talk about some pork bellies, pork bellies. I'm like, what the? Is that really pork belly? You got to talk now. Oh, it's not like, is that really pork belly? Or that's a nickname for something. Is pork? I never heard of it. They used to talk about pork bellies all the time. Mm, isn't that nice? You can't open the door for yourself. You're standing there that whole time waiting on that. I never would have took Dan Aykroyd for this type of character, though. So they must have been brothers. I never know that. Yeah, I didn't realize that. I do know that they were in Coming to America. Mortimer, we're back. Yes. Let's sell now. Let's see if Winthorpe's right. We just made an extra three hundred and forty-seven thousand mm, dollars. I wonder how much that will be in today's market. Cold New York streets, man. Woohoo! Merry Christmas! Look at this photo. <laughs> I was wondering when he was gonna come up. I have no money to give you. Please. Uh -uh. <laughs> Uh-uh. I know he must have pickpocketed him. How close he got. January crop report. Exactly as we thought, Randolph. And Everything Dolph. was we're a gamble with them. Bet and gamble. And you're talking else to me about... Mother always said you were greedy. She meant it as a compliment. <laughs> I bet you thought I'd forgotten your Christmas bonus. There you are. Was that a $2 bill? $5. Oh, $5. Oh. Maybe I'll go to the movies by myself. <laughs> oh hell no! See, that's <laughs> that's how they a lot of them be too cheap like that. Uh, I mean, that's how you stay rich. Shh. Shoot, he got him a job. Do act like he rely on tips. I'll be having dinner with Penelope tonight. Oh, lucky you! It's not luck. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him! Back. All the bougies. I wonder whose idea was it for this movie. We seem to be paying some of our employees an awful lot of money. Can't get around the old minimum wage, Mortimer. See? <clears throat> <clears throat> Dang, I didn't get a good look at that. He's doing something top secret for us. Research. I mean, I understand you can't really ask enemies, questions Winsorp. with him being you your boss, but you can't well, fall for that BS. Try, good work, Winthorpe. Winthorpe, the names that they have. Look at this fool scooting. <laughs> Man, I would have been that tired. Hey, baby, what's happening? What are you doing? I'll be looking. 
if you don't get off of me. <laughs> she, hey, she fine, man, and I love her hair. I'll be spitting that game, too. Boy, I would holler up and knock that hat off his head. You, you don't get your, kick them teeth in. Get off of me. You were in Nam, um, so were we. Where? I was in um, Sang Bang, Dangon. <laughs> Uh, uh, I was all over the place, basically. Yeah, it was real hush-hush. I was Agent Orange. That was my name, Agent Orange. <laughs> I mean, he's doing his best. At least he's trying. <laughs> Look how he's in there. Look at the scat. Look at the scat. I can walk, Jesus! Praise Jesus! <laughs> <laughs> you can say that he had a mental condition. Look at me. This is too much. What a happy day. What I hope he didn't have his money in the I little cart, though. <laughs> How many hats he get on? I think he's doing a little bit too much. Like they already let him go. Like a crackhead somewhere. Oh, don't shit. Take it, take it. Please don't kill me. I'm getting back. <laughs> you <laughs> Come on, Cecil. You've been sitting here the whole time, man. You know I didn't try to rob this dude. I know you looking dead at it. These dudes are uh -uh. so over dramatic. Get out of the way. Get out. He's getting away. There he is. Is there a problem, officers? Dang, just because he's black, man. <laughs> and I guess because he's dressed like he's homeless, too. Right. You have a history of juvenile arrests, I presume. Drug okay. abuse, reform schools, okay. state okay. prisons. Okay. Yeah, this this dude sounds weird, bro. There's absolutely nothing wrong with him. I can prove it. He's a Negro. Oh, dang, I didn't think he was going to be going that far. Uh -uh. Right. I, I already had a feeling that he was racist <laughs> when he was talking about genetics. Negro. <laughs> he looked Given at the, the camera right like, man, can you believe this? Are we talking about a wager, Randolph? See, everything's a bit with that. Why did, would you even want to do this? I guess what, to save money? Because, you know, he's black. And because he grew up poor. Yeah, they get out of money and get nothing. So they probably can is a... finesse him. We've done it before. This time it's in a good See? cause. This time's a good cause. How's it good? The usual amount. Why not? Now, I know the whole bet thing might be a little over-exaggerated, but I know that they still do that to this day, setting people up. But he could have killed you. In such a situation, instinct takes over. It's either kill or be killed. <laughs> <laughs> so he's trying to spit that game while she over here dressed like a 12-year-old girl. Yo, this dude cannot cook. What is he making? I want you, Lewis, now. No dessert, sir. You have it. He's like, I don't want this trash. Exactly. <laughs> this dude know he don't know how to cook. They cooking the more fancy. Meals. He probably lied on his oh, resume. Mr. A scientific experiment. What a scumbag. Say right? Just push. Department of Agriculture gets those estimates from all over the country. Pork belly. <laughs> that is not sexy and. <laughs> Just gonna have a normal conversation like that while getting undressed? Okay. Turn off. Excuse me, sir. What is it now, Coleman? Will you be needing me anymore this evening, sir? <laughs> he don't be no. doing. <laughs> I think I have everything. Good night, sir. I know. <laughs> he knew exactly what he was doing. He came in the block. You had to make sure the dude had his payroll before I made my move. Tell us how you cut him. Oh, snap, it's John Carlo. Esposito. Where they find that rope to crawl on the back of the wall? You gotta make sure you yeah, shake your face. Right? He, look how young he is, how he looks. Look. It's crazy. How come I don't see no marks on you? Yeah. Yeah, yeah they obviously was not listening. The they was too busy hating. You don't, you don't know that because you're a big Barry White looking mother. <laughs> <laughs> A little scrawny. Mr. Big Time Pimp. Yeah. <laughs> hey, look, sit down, all right? It ain't cool being no jive turkey. Jive so turkey. So close to Thanksgiving. Why are they walking like that? Be all some little scrawny looking, talking crazy. You know you with in cell number four? Nice, <laughs> yo! Billy Ray Valentine. You made bail. I did? Hey, at least he still kept his composure. Yeah, he gonna play it. You know, that's how we do play it. I went to the end. Terrified. Yeah. Trying to... See, even if I do get a black eye. Hey, hey, May I suggest you the nice stick officer? Get out of here. <laughs> He's like, where do I go? Whiskey. All you want. 
Hey, just because I'm black, you think I want some right? Yeah, I'm like, you know, I ain't with that whiskey, but give me a give me a shot. Let me try. There's so many young comedians on the circuit that look just like Eddie Murphy, man. Man, he started a whole revolution. Yeah, I'd be like, I hope this ain't no cheap whiskey. Either. I just drink the best. That's smart that he took all the cigars. He can sell those on the street. We're going to start you at $80,000 a year. See, when the white dudes probably get paid a little bit more than that. <laughs> You're right. Then these dudes a couple of in, huh? <laughs> <laughs> right? Maybe. Right, maybe. maybe. That's what they do. There's a lot of dudes uh, yeah, do. to get that power, man. They into some weird stuff. Well, I'm not saying like that's weird, but saying like some dudes, they into like getting pegged and all that. They into wearing like those those like leather suits or whatever. Yeah. I'm Randolph Duke. How you doing, Randy? What's happening? My younger brother, Mortimer. Hey, Marte, what it is? Hey, <laughs> Marte. <laughs> Randy, that's like Randy Jackson from the Jackson 5. <laughs> <laughs> this dude does not know anything about the Jacksons. Come on now. He'll look after your day-to-day -day needs. Are they putting them in the other dude's house? <laughs> what do you say? Wait a minute. Yeah, perhaps your coat, sir. Uh, yes, this is my coat. But may I take it? Get out of here, man. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I don't know what you want. Could you look at me, sir? <laughs> you see, man, I knew y'all was f***ed, man. <laughs> hey, right. It's a world f***. Hey, hey, bubbles, man. <laughs> <laughs> Look, he's still, he's still the stuff. He understands, Randall. Look at <laughs> uh, William. I did not notice that. He's smart. Uh-huh. Right. Yeah. It, it look, I like my home. It's very nice. I have very nice tasting houses. I like Everything. It. Look he, at he he still believe in none of that. Right. Then you go tell me this is my personal slave, too. And I feel what you <laughs> I can play like Harlem Globe try to shit with it, right? Okay, you want Mellow Lemon shit, right? Oh. Wow, that was a real expensive base right there. Can you get some glue? I think we paid $35,000 for it. We estimated its value at $50,000 for the insurance company. William has already made us a profit of $15,000. Oh, I thought he said $50,000. <laughs> you want me to break something else? No. <laughs> <laughs> this is straight dirty, man. I guess this is one of the things you could say is like kind of like a sellout. It ain't really a no, because he didn't know. He he knows about the whole thing now. It's just because they gave him a choice if he wanted to leave or not. Yeah. But, uh, he said, nah, I want the money. But I think the majority of people would take that right? choice. But I'd be scared. I'd be real too scared. Like some ain't. No. Why? 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 Yeah, you don't know if it's like some Illuminati stuff. B right? You're going to de-skin me later or something. Drink my blood. <laughs> Oh, it's the dude from Breakfast Club. Excuse me. Sorry. There is a thief, mm. and he's sitting here among us. Among us! Mm. You got to be more careful. Dang, it's crazy. That's how we start with this whole thing? That's messed up. They got the whole club in on this. And that's straight embarrassing. You're going to embarrass me in front of everybody like that. The fact that there's an X on there, man, that is fishy. But they're all in on it. Now this is totally preposterous. This is insane. I have no reason to steal. Strip you little shit before I tell you a new ass. This man is physically threatening me. <laughs> Dang. That's what? I've never seen that before in my life. How did they put that in there? That's PCP. PCP, how you ain't go crazy? Man, that's probably just regular flour. <laughs> Can't wait to show out. That's how we. Sure, I know I would. You got a lot of nerves showing your face around here after all this time. He looks familiar. I think I've seen him in something else. Yeah, the people have seen him a lot of things, but I can't remember all what it is. Billy Ray, honey, is that you? Who you think it is? Yeah, yeah it is Chicken Head. She, she looked like a bird. Yeah. You the mother I was gonna call. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Motherfucker. That has to be an Eddie Murphy joke with this dude just keep saying, yeah. Yeah. Took care of him, baby. I was gonna kick his ass. Come on, everybody. Oh, you're getting it on, boy. I'll be right over here. We can party too. Be like, hey, man, let's get up. Yep. Yep. <laughs> I'll have them at least change the music though. Of course, they all off beat. Studio 54, I think it's what it was back in the day. Music. Hey, yo, cuz, you gonna vomit the bathroom downstairs. 
downstairs, man. I'm trying to rob you, bro. You, you already know the game. You already know the people you invited here. Right. She, she looked like you know a crackhead. Folks are <laughs> Have you people ever heard of posters? That's funny. I didn't even think he was just gonna be caring like that. Oh, oh snap, it's that type of movie. Get your clothes on and get out of here. Are you really mad about that? Everybody getting naked. Look at that with, with her bony back. What was that for? I couldn't do all that in front of everybody like that. Look like she need to be in Sesame Street. The way her hair looking. Look, yeah, like, close your eyes. Close your eyes. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> hey, Get the f out! Get him! I would too. Get your out! Look, he's so lit. He had him a good time. Now, I'll, I'll have her. I'll tell her to stay. She was already comfortable, so. You are the most righteous. Yeah, right. Just get the f out, man. Let's go. Right? Shit. Come on. <laughs> There wasn't no friends of mine, Coleman. It was a bunch of freeloaders treating my house like it was a goddamn zoo. You can only be mad at yourself. Thanks, man. Dang, I guess nobody ever told this dude thank you before. They've not none of them. Shh. What? The privilege? You should be privileged to be in their presence. Why should they tell you thank you, them type of folk? I'd you like to make a fast hunt. I just got out. <laughs> well, what are y'all doing in the police department in the first place? Uh, he digging in his toes. That's like going to Grady. That's how we send him to Grady <laughs> Hospital. We waiting on you. I'm like, what? I'm like, if you don't get your ass up off of me, them big glasses, and him picking at his toes, I'm like, I smell. Penelope, do you realize where I've been since yesterday? Beans. Uh, she made f beans. What the f? <laughs> Those men wanted to have sex with me. That's this somewhere else, Mom? I think they did, man. They was putting their clothes on. And uh, since you're saying you stink, yeah. what you supposed to do with it? Smell good in the jail? You only been there for a day. You stink already. Right. Like that, bad. With Almighty God as my witness, I am not an angel dust dealer. You just put it on your mama, bro. <laughs> I'm hurting, baby. I just need a show. Please. Lewis. <laughs> Who's this person? I've never seen this woman before. Don't say it to me. I mean, I'd rather be with Jamie Lee Curtis, to be honest with you. I'm back. I'll do all the <clears throat> things you like. <gasps> Whoa, right here in front of the police station? And he's not even fighting it. <laughs> Yo, I can't knock him though. It'd be hilarious if she was actually doing something when they was like arguing. Oh, yeah, we may I mean, she hasn't got up yet. You don't think they give these to just anyone, do you? Well, I don't take credit cards. Tell me all those were credit cards? You ain't got no debit cards, man? They probably canceled out all his cards, though. Yeah, but he ain't broke, though. He got money in the bank. They probably took it out. They put a soft freeze on it. He can't, they can't do that. Yeah, it's they his, did. It's his account. They put a freeze on the watch. I mean, unless they own the bank. It was like a company bank, then all right. There's no Coleman here. You've made a mistake. Man, he don't feel nothing for this dude. All this time taking care of me? Excuse me. I loved women's hair in the 80s, man. So you like that big hair? Yeah. Sorry, Mr. Winthorpe, but the IRS has frozen your accounts. What are you Didn't talking you? about? You know me. You're a heroin dealer, Mr. Winthorpe. <laughs> this is some Angel BS, PCP, bro. And I never even you tell me they get that much pull? Come on. May I see your credit cards, please? No. I've been ordered to repossess them. What? This is against my rights right here. And rights aren't rights if someone can take them away. Well, at least you know he ain't lying. He was who she- Man, it don't even matter about that. I want my money. Right. <laughs> because you helped them do this to me. Oh, that's funny. Well, she really think, oh, this is a joke. Girl, I'll pull that wig off your head. Come on, get in. See, Jamie Lee Curtis, she ain't got to tell me twice. Yeah, that brother's yes, starving. Yes, sir, brother. <laughs> it looked just like the dude that had me busted. Right, that? right there. He looked just like the mother- uh, I mean, he looks- just like the gentleman that had me busted. Man, you acting like that's your dad or something, man. You can cuss. <laughs> that's so messed up. They took everything from this dude. How's that even possible? There's some strange going on here. Right. What they ain't believe in giving no hairlines back then, did it? Cut no hairline yeah, person. I can't do it? Yes, everybody wanted to be like Dr. Martin Luther King, because I don't think he really had a hairline either. He didn't get his hair cut. This is one crazy bet that you really think you can just pull some random dude off the street and he would know how to handle finances like this. 
No thanks, guys. I already had breakfast this morning. Just bread and bacon? What in the world? Agricultural products. Pork bellies, which is used to make bacon and lettuce and tomato sandwich. Oh, so he does look at the camera. What? <laughs> Yo, I didn't know this movie had fourth wall breaking. Like this girl was living in an abandoned you building. My this betrayal, I don't understand it. Wow, her spot looks nice. Now, you want me to help you out? I expect a lot in return. These were here when I moved in. Put them on if you want. What? <laughs> she be, you make more money than him. Dude, where is he gonna get a job now with that on his record? This dude probably couldn't even get a job at McDowell's. The only thing I got going for me in this whole big wide world is this body, this face, and what I got up here. <laughs> That's what we do. That's what we do. I don't have a pimp. Oh, she says she's self-employed. Okay. I've saved 42 grand and it's in T-bills earning interest. I help you get yourself back on your feet and you pay me five figures. If they was to remake this movie, it would be pay me a million or something like that. <laughs> you sleep on the couch. Why would you do that? Like, come on. Why, like, why would you tease me like that? Why would you take your clothes out front of like that? Right in front of it. Come. Like, dang, I appreciate the view. But like, why? <laughs> Price is going to keep going down. It's Christmas time. Everybody's uptight. And Christmas is around the corner. And I ain't going to have no money to buy my son the G.I. Joe. And my wife ain't going to want to. My wife ain't going to make love to me. <laughs> <laughs> He's right, Mortimer. My God, look at it. Money isn't everything, Randolph. Hey, bro, can you give me my props? Why I know you racist, but like, come on now. We're gonna be late. Yeah, sure, I also know he's mad about that bet, too. Yeah, he's like a trap. So they wouldn't have to do much if they wanted to trap him with him being black. So let me count it. I'm sure it is, William. Thank you. I keep looking at me. All right. I say that I'm Oh my God. Oh, Y'all really boy. liking this? Come on, man. This song is about whack. These girls are easy to please. Constance on the make. Constance Fry. Constance Fry. Oh, how boring. Spring or fall. Ugh. Oh my God, I don't believe it. This looks like something that'll be in a high school movie right oh, here. Oh, I know she can bear oh, every so be best. I'll handle this, Pokums. Pokums, oh. The important thing is that I can rely on you, my friends, as character witnesses. Do look like a 50 cent version of Christopher Reeve. Well, I wondered if you could see your way clear to perhaps advance me a small loan until the hearing. <laughs> Frankly, Winfrey. I was never good at enough friends for that. Nobody wants to buy your drugs here, Louie. <laughs> wow, how quick she moved on. Mm. Y'all was about to get married. Handcrafted in Switzerland and water resistant to three atmospheres. Watch of the 80s. <laughs> this dude is killing me with this performance. It's worth 50 bucks. Okay, I thought this was New York, so it's Philadelphia. You gotta go to a different pawn shop, man. No, he's still wouldn't get it. Pawn shop ain't gonna give you no money for nothing. How much for the gun? Man, that boy desperate now. Come on, so, man. You better than this. This snail is standing in front of the Cadillac sales of the seat. Thanks. And uh, that's how you know you moved up. Man. They got that boy a white woman. <laughs> Look, he's running around like wet raccoon. Yes, and, I want and on top of the car, I want another big S. I want everybody to say, Look at that S car go. Oh, my God. Yeah. That's that rich guy joke. <laughs> I guess, uh, you know, the effort that counts. The Russian weed harvest isn't gonna be as bad as everybody thinks. And two... It's like, this dude is a natural. That's amazing. Judging from all these jewels around your girlfriend's neck here, I think you'll need every penny you got just to keep her happy. Oh, that's his girl. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I know he heavy. It <laughs> coat with all that water wet on there. Man, right there next to her, right. man. Okay. And Bo? She was. Well, she only with him because of the money. She don't really care. It's moved into my house. He's stolen my job. I have. To I'm like, I'm boy, I'm so tired of hearing about this. Shut up. I like that fit. My mama just came in from out of town. Can we do it next week? 
<laughs> he thought it was gonna get to pop it. Pop. Dude probably wasn't gonna last no more than three seconds anyway. That's all you need anyway. You be doing too much. Please! Please! Now! Oh, boy, he ain't getting in the bed with that fool. He could tie you just. What, what, what's going on right here? She ain't saying no words. I guess she's trying to get the business. <laughs> you get naked and you are not getting ready to get this little fluffy butt in nothing naked no you're not getting out of bed though until it's normal i feel fine and i've inconvenienced you enough nobody works on christmas eve <laughs> not on, gonna you make can you get nice a lot of clients on christmas eve yeah jamie lee curtis man is one of a kind she's still fine to this day i'll give him a christmas present he'll never forget never forget <laughs> I completely forgot that this was a Christmas movie, man. <laughs> oh, look at that nasty, uh... Get the bologna ham or whatever. Like, what type of food is this? This food looks kind of whack. He was wrapping up in a napkin, a paper towel or something. Toast, oh, baby. In here. Toast. That beard is. Dude, really he been crawling like, like he that. been working out there doing oil changes. Uh, oh with my that God. beard. Uh, what is that? I don't know. The fact that he looks just so dirty. I'm surprised. And yeah, ain't nobody ain't here. said nothing, right? <laughs> he done found all the drugs <laughs> in the world. Marijuana joints. Pills, quaalude. Where all that money did you have to pay for it? That's a lot of money to buy all that. Hello, security. Merry Christmas. <laughs> I don't know nothing about your house and your car and your job, really. Can you put that gun away? Will you ask the dupes? I didn't you think he was going to be pulling the gun on them. I thought he was going to be pulling the gun on his friends. I probably would have came out that building just shooting. Where did he find that nasty <laughs> Santa Claus? Hobo Santa Claus. That guy belongs behind bars. He's unemployed, Valentine. Obviously hungry. Oh, but he has money to buy drugs, right? Right. Listen, you can't be soft on people like that. <laughs> <laughs> right. What he, I, he took the weed. Yeah. He got with some Mad Dog 2020. You can at least drink when you get home. I wouldn't even smoke that because you wouldn't even know exactly what's in it. That's true, that. They don't smell that. They trying to check to see if somebody's in there. <laughs> there was no point in doing that. Pay up, Mortimer. I've won the bet. Here, one dollar. Right, one dollar. <laughs> what's the bet? Oh, wait, okay. What? All that for one dollar? One dollar. They ruined the dude's life for a dollar. That's crazy. I don't want Winthorpe back after what he's done. You mean keep Valentine on as managing director? Do you really believe I would have a n run our fa Yo! What? <laughs> I didn't think he was going to go that strong. But like I said, you know, he is racist. We got that crop report New Year's Eve. If uh, Mr. Beaks does what we paid him to do. Oh, that's the dude from Breakfast Club. I will say these are some good villains, though. But it is, like, really ridiculous. Here you go. Winslow! I look like that was probably improv right there. Yeah, it was. It's good. It's good. Look, he's a bit burly. Look at him. I like that. Yeah, that's one of the things I'm working on myself when it comes to acting like you're drunk. There's a lot of people, they naturally go over the top with it. He play. Look at it. He playing the mess out of that boy. Oh, I would die if he sat next to me, Jesus. I was like, Lord, please, no. You sit next to me. Ugh. 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 You got hair all up. Ugh. You gonna eat it? Oh. Ugh. Ugh. Boy, get. Ugh. To eat the hair. I would die. <laughs> I would die. Ugh. I would die. Ugh. Oh. Oh. Oh my God. <laughs> Oh boy, John. Look at it, look at it. He leaning. He gangster leaning, boy, with that. They are doing the absolute most right here. Look at it. He playing the mess out of it. He peeing on him for it. Oh, 
Yeah. Oh. Oh, dog peeing on him. <laughs> I mean, hey. why not? Yeah, I mean, everything else. Yeah. He does stink. smell like it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, why not rinse the pee off in the dirt? Oh, now that's not the answer, man. Come on now. God just saved your life right there. Right? Hi, Louie. Merry Christmas. Oh, my God. Louie, when you get out, I have a big surprise for you. Golly, what type of tree is that? How the heck you knew he went into this building? Right. I'll make sure good, got clean cut with that. Boy, I haven't seen him dressed like that since Ooh, uh, he coming to America. Good. I seen him in a uh, real person. He's still as old as he is. Good when I was on coming to America, and he looked good then. I'm like, oh, Eddie Murphy still look good. Oh, I didn't know that people was really into him like that. I wasn't until I was right there face to face with him. I was like, oh, I was starstruck. I ain't starstruck on nobody, but I was when I seen him. I had the most absurd nightmare. <laughs> I was poor and no one liked me. It was all because of this terrible, awful Negro. Negro. <laughs> <laughs> it was the Dukes. It was the Dukes. <laughs> Dukes ruined my life over a bet. For how much? A dollar. I wouldn't a dollar. <laughs> Be like people tipping me a dollar. Disrespectful. The cheek, the nerve, the gall, the audacity, and the gumption. You know, you can't just go run and shoot people in the kneecaps with a double barrel shotgun because you pissed at them. That's going to have you go <laughs> right to prison. The best way you hurt rich people is by turning them into poor people. Right. I have to admit, sir, you didn't like it yourself a bit. This dude uh, got no, three you. guns. For what? Just to take photos with? No, dang well, you don't be using those. To the Department of Agriculture in Washington, D.C. Louis, that's him. That's the guy who paid me to talk dirty to you. He probably does a lot of dirty work for him. I mean, like we just saw, but they do it with other people. They probably had some people murdered and stuff. He looks like he's ready. At 2100 hours tomorrow. Hold on. Fuck off. Hey, like your mama? Pick up that damn phone. He just Debo. The dude's always been a jerk. Yeah, man. Oh. Yeah, I was about to say, I had a feeling that was probably a cameo. I forgot who that was. I know I've seen him before. Though. I forget his name. I need you to hold the baby now. Look at how gorgeous she is. Yeah, but I forget his name. I can't believe I forget his name. Because just the way that he just came out like that, it was like a sitcom or something. Ever you make it with an eight? Oh, wow, they're giving him more screen time. Okay. Kiss his beautiful way. Come on, give me a look. Come on, give me a look. He used to be really comical, funny too. They always did movies together, them two. And I cannot remember his name. Dang, I can't believe I can't remember that. And dude right here too. Yeah, I think he looks somewhat familiar. Uh, no, don't you remember this morning you drove the ship. Yeah, <laughs> he said, oh, for real? That's what we doing right now? All right, cool. Let me get out this cage. Come on, man. What type of disguise is that? He knows what this, this dude country, looks like. Or is he just racist too? He think all black people look alike. I am Nanja Ibuko, exchange student from Cameroon. Ha 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 no. No. Beef jerky time. Beef jerky time. They going all out right here for this third act. <laughs> well, that's kind of you, son. And a happy new year to you, too. I, I, could, could I offer either of you two? <laughs> look at the way you look at this. I know this is kind of like a joke. Where they'd be like a rabbi, a priest, and somebody else walk into a bar or something. Right. Beef jerky? Oh, no, son. Thank you very much. No, what type of beef jerky is that, man? Terrible. They look like dried peppers. They said, give me give me wind something terrible. We are moving. We are moving. Look at <laughs> I am Inga from Sweden. <laughs> but you're wearing later hosen. Why would y'all sit next to him eat a banana? I mean, really? They're drunk. So they eating all his well, food. Well, where are you from? Oh, they eating his food. Yeah. I, I'm hungry, man. Something more to eat. <laughs> or, uh, maybe I want me that bowl be trying to eat that yeah, That boy yeah, took yeah, them yeah, bananas yeah, yeah. back like, bro, yeah, I said y'all can have some, not all of them. Who is that? 
open the door, man. <laughs> right. <laughs> like, dumbass, open the damn door. I, 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 I certainly hope there's enough space on the train for me. Oh. Well, you know, the, yeah, this, 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 this was the 80s. <laughs> Yo, this had to have been an Eddie Murphy joke right here. Wow, Don't catch that really? dang hair on fire. You gotta have a big joint. <laughs> Winthorpe. Hey, how do you know it was him? He had blackface. Hey, I'll rip out your eyes and piss on your brain. Dang. Excuse me. You got it. <laughs> We're gonna take a little walk and don't try anything funny or the whore loses a kidney. Dude, it's three of us. I understand he got a gun, but you tell me you can't jump him? And then run all these people in here? Oh, you, oh I've been to get away. I'm the biggest, baddest boy in the jungle. Get lost, you maggot. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that dude nosy. But hey, at least he's coming to help us. The party's over. Party's over! I think John Bellucci, if I'm saying that right, right? Yeah, I think it's John Bellucci. Am I saying John Bellucci? I'm not sure. No, if I'm no, saying no, that no, right. no, no, John it's, it's I not forget him. his name. I think he had a TV show. He was like one he of those was. TV dads or something. Come on, loosen up, man. man he does not care that he has a gun. Are you serious? <laughs> he tied him up in the. Uh... <laughs> hey! Look what happened to me, huh? That black one must be the female. <laughs> See, that's the best way to get revenge right there. Mm. Where is he? Pigs! Shoot, both of them dudes need to get me? locked up. They the ones that need to get it. I'm over here. That's it. Okay, toss it over. I can already tell they had a blast making this movie. Sure, I'm trying to get into stocks myself, man. That stuff is hard. Boy, uh, it's tripping now. I worked real hard for this, Louie. Hope you know what you're doing. Shoot, if I was Eddie, I'll be trying to get with her. Coleman, oh, would you please? Thank you. Man, he ain't your butler no more. Oh, I thought, oh, she, was hey, gonna, no. I thought she was gonna give it to him. So you need it more than her. Like, girl, if you don't keep your gun. They was kissing like it was in a video game or something. And it's your on the back. <laughs> I could use a stiff drink. Would you get a joint? I ain't gonna take this girl, man. You're just working for him. Nice to see those. I'm thinking that was the Twin Towers back in the day. I think. Yeah, yeah, it was. That's why I said it was nice to see them. Because that's where they did all the money, stocks, and all that. It was there. How's the Elsa, Harry? <laughs> Pretty good. Oh, that ain't gonna help the Elsa. Man, that toupee is so noticeable. Money is the root of all evil, man. All those dudes there, driven by greed. Mm. They trade everything. Gold, silver, cocoa and sugar, and of course, frozen concentrated orange juice. Why? What's so good about orange juice? Traders. This looks like this is real footage. This isn't part of the movie. One, two, three, four, one, eight, four. How would I be able to hear anybody with all this chaos? Are we probably getting orders wrong and stuff? The Dukes are trying to corner the market. Let's get in on it. Heck yeah. You got a lot of these dudes broke. Sell going in April of 142! <laughs> what in the world? This is just madness. What are they doing here? I know this dude, Eddie Murphy's character, is having the time of his life. Just all this random stuff happening. And then you got a chance to become a millionaire. The orange crop estimates for the next year. Could you move any slower? I know, so, right? Really? Calculate the cold winter has apparently not affected the orange harvest. I mean, wouldn't these old dudes know how to make some money again? They've been doing this for a long time. <laughs> Dude, look like you need to be in a cartoon. 200. Hey, 100? Oh, yeah, I, I wouldn't be able to do something like this, man. I would not be able to pay attention. And I don't even know what these numbers mean. How could you do this to us after everything we've done for you? I done know you, you didn't. Bro, you just called oh, me just an N-word. Lewis bet me that we couldn't both get rich and put y'all in the poorhouse at the same time. Right, right. I lost. 
One dollar. You right, know. there you go. I probably would have been a little bit more uh, disrespectful and been like a quarter or something. Right. We don't have $394 million in cash. Dang. The uh, Duke Brothers seats on the exchange up for sale at once. Oh. We're ruined. Uh. How doesn't both of y'all have like $390 million with the business that y'all was running? Oh my God. Mortimer, your brother's not well. We better call an ambulance. Fuck him. Ah. Right now, get those brokers <laughs> back in here. That's what they get. Hmm. Dude, show this true colors mm. right there. Where's Beaks? Where in the hell is Beaks? Oh, that dude going to a whole different Dude's continent. By the uh gorilla. Take a look. They're in love. <laughs> he just accepting it. What they get. You already got it in the butt a couple times, son. But I don't know what's the problem. Like, his hands is free. He could take the duct tape off his face. Looking good, Billy Ray. Feeling good, Lewis. Got him new friends. I like that sweater, though. Oh, I like what they're doing right here with the credits. What's up? Shoot. All right, Mom. So you know, he you played Odell Jones, remember? Yeah. I loved it. And you know, it's been so long since I've watched the movie. It's so many things that I didn't even realize the, the racism, things they were saying. I don't know where I was at. I was like younger and I didn't even get that. I don't know what. And it was just blatant. Where was I at? I don't know. Sure. Hey, if y'all enjoyed our reaction to this, you know, please like the video, share, comment down below, subscribe, click the bell so you know when up uh, or more videos and follow both of us on our social medias. Links will be down in the description below, man. Uh, I actually felt like this movie was fantastic. It wasn't as funny as I was hoping it to be, but it still was a fantastic movie. Probably one of the best comments comedies I've seen in a minute when it just comes to this, the overall movie, how it was put together, the acting, the directing, writing, just the story in general, man. It was really nice. Okay, everybody, and there we go with Trading Places. I would say the performances really threw me off. Like a lot of people was doing a really good job. The jokes were pretty cool. Like I said, it wasn't as funny as I was hoping it to be, but I still enjoyed this movie. I can understand why a lot of people love this movie, especially with a lot of stuff that this movie was hitting on. And when it just comes to the story in general, way more than just a comedy. I just was in love seeing the young Eddie Murphy at, at heart. He was one of the, my favorites. Yeah, I don't think I've ever seen him that young unless uh, the Mr. Rogers or Robinson skits that he did on SNL he did before this movie or uh, was delirious before this movie. I, I don't know. I would actually go ahead and give this movie uh, A minus. See, what would you get? Uh, maybe a B. Love how he was acting drunk with that dirty Santa Claus. Yeah. I love that part. It was one of my favorite parts in here too. So. All right. Well, hey, y'all got our grades and our thoughts from it. Can't wait to hear y'all thoughts in the comments below. And if you like for my mom to come on for future videos, I'll definitely try my best to get her on. Uh, but with all that being said, we'll see y'all in the next one. All right. Peace.